mm. i mean having touched a little bit about clients customers yeah um how do you price and deal with clients okay so i'll speak of it from the entertainment industry side mm. uh okay so now there are two ways when you can go about pricing one thing is if a client and comes and says i need an illustrator to do this Mm. or i need direct domnic disuse to do this mm. Mm. so when yeah. they come for the second i can charge how much ever based on whatever <laughs> like, like there's no limit yeah. like they i can either do it for a very small price if i care passionate and these people need it or i can go way up if it's a brand you know i can charge anything at the point mm. over mm. there based on what i feel is right now when it is the other way around you need to be well aware of what the industry rates are at least from this entertainment industry mm-hmm. side you can't charge more because they need an illustrator they don't need you yeah. Yeah. or they need a graphic designer they don't need you so that's where it's good to know what the rates are and mm-hmm. especially at where you stand if you're just early experience it's not hard to find the rates you can google it or simply send a mail asking someone what the what the general rates are you don't ask them what their rates people are very private mm-hmm. about that you just ask generally what do you think i could get for somebody who has this much experience and you have to go with that because you can't come out of college being a star already it's very yeah. hard to do that with you have a lot of demand so you have to go with what the industry is that being said the industry rates are very different if your clients are from india or from a different place oh, yeah. yeah for sure so you can be very smart about that and but the thing is knowledge is power here mm-hmm. the more information you have the more you can go back and it's not hard to send a mail to someone who is maybe a year ahead of you because it's always easier to approach someone who's just little ahead of you right. as opposed to approaching someone 10 years 20 years ahead yeah. mm-hmm. so you can send a mail saying hey i'm new to this so could you please let me know what the breakdown is how long do you does it usually take or in the agency how many revisions you get all that information you just kind of go with it because at this point you're not unique enough to charge whatever you have to go to the industry to build up yourself to get finances all of that but like i said when it comes to the second stage where you have created enough demand and people want you this can be fashion designer this can be all of that then you have more power there because you have that advantage mm-hmm. so yeah 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 i think uh, again it's extremely subjective yeah first of all um but yeah i think i would say how much value you're providing to them mm-hmm. yeah that is the first question i mean small business versus a big brand again it's so subjective but yeah. i would say a small business you definitely need to know i like i do a lot of research mm-hmm. about my pers- about the person who's approaching me yeah. if if someone sent me an email they're like oh we need to brand something mm-hmm. i'm stalking them everywhere yeah. <laughs> first of all i'm going to see if they pop up on google what's their instagram like cuz i'm going to do some research now yeah. Yeah. to actually see how much do you care yeah. first of all about this yeah. like do you, and i'm probably going to have like one or two meetings just yeah. to make sure if that is in the same vibe and, and like you said like if I I would get to know maybe the first two meetings yeah. maybe like 50% how much time they're actually going to be taking on mine yeah. if they're going to be very particular that oh my god this like some people are hard to deal with in yeah. terms of just getting a decision out of them right mm. mm. and it's hard it's a it's a, it's luck also you have to play ball yeah. yeah like what what is it that do do will I be spending the next 6 months convincing them yeah. Yeah. that this is the right thing for them and then i have to price them for the 6 months yeah uh versus someone who's like okay i'm probably going to do this um, film campaign and i need like a poster yeah. and this mm-hmm. is the release date so i know that this can't go beyond this yeah mm-hmm. so now i know first of all i know the time line and i also know the value but like the value part is something that plays the most amount of someone yeah. like some dhaba owner comes to me and they're like i want to make a logo yeah like what yeah, do i do yeah. so i know that okay maybe like we have the rapo i'm going to make something quick yeah. i might not even charge them yeah, yeah exactly. i'm going to be like i'm probably going to get two butter chickens and yeah. <laughs> three naans for take away yeah or something like that but like again like if some brand comes and i know what is they going to what 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 is this artwork going to do for them yeah how how long they're going to be using it and where all it's going to be printed yeah. i'll probably get to know that okay this is how much i think i need to be paid yeah. to compensate for uh, this time but but also from from someone who's entering or for me as well like i fucking do nike's all the time till yeah. i'm going to keep on doing it till i get their attention probably yeah. and i'm i still feel i'm i'm nowhere close to like industry people yet. yeah i still feel that i'm probably like getting there i'm trying to get as much as i can yeah. and 
if they come up to me probably i'm i'm going to approach it in a very different way because i want to work with them mm, this yeah. is not that they want something this is something that i want so my yeah. ego is going to be extremely aside yeah. or not even ego like my my want for money yeah. and my my desire to get like paid yeah is going to be different because my, then they, the value that i'm i'm going to get from them is something that's going to matter to me yeah. maybe like if i get featured on um, um some of some of the design industry so okay i did something yeah. that's going to be my take away yeah. uh from that and yeah i like in in fourth year i did this one uh, installation in in a metro station yeah and uh, when i was done doing that I got I got a lot of people who uh, I got a lot of traction from people who are walking yeah. around mm-hmm. and then people are like oh fuck you, how much how much did you charge for this and I was yeah. like I didn't because this was like my graduation project but yeah. then they're like you should ask um the metro department <laughs> for money <laughs> like to keep this yeah. going and then because the vinyl is almost it's like a installation probably yeah. can, I don't know how you're going to show it to yeah. people but like yeah it's it's a pretty cool um uh, win that I had but again it's it's it becomes subjective because now again it's a public art piece yeah. mm. sort of sorts and my client wasn't like the metro station it was like a crowd it was like a csr funded right. project yeah. which maybe I, I i don't even know where the money would come from i may yeah. Yeah. but like yeah it's it's again that, that's the value that i'm getting right. from yeah. from people coming in and playing the game maybe 2% of it probably is going to read some a3 size poster that i'd put yeah okay this is the guy so they'll put a story and i would it would like really melt my heart if i don't know anyone like who's this random person <laughs> um yeah. putting it on like and writing like, paragraphs in kannada about it mm-hmm. yeah this is great like this is yeah. what i want to do and yeah. i'm sending them like a thank you message that wow yeah. man i'm so yeah. grateful that you played this game yeah. and even i can't read but i know that i hope it's a positive message yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> because i can see hearts yeah. so it was cool yeah. so that's again like the value that i'm getting would would definitely define yeah. um has the introduction of ai for